The goal of our research ultimately is to develop improved varieties of cowpea that will enable smallholder farmers to produce more food from the same effort. Our research project forms a tremendous training opportunity for building human capacity in Africa. If we can develop improved varieties with pest and disease resistance, then we don't need to have a lot of the chemical-based pesticide controls that are less sustainable and less environmentally friendly. Currently, we produce our liquid fuels from petroleum. Petroleum use is one of the largest emitters of carbon dioxide, which can lead to global climate change. If we want sustainable liquid fuels, we have no choice but to use biomass. What we're really trying to do is focus on how to understand and improve those steps for conversion of biomass into fuel so we can get really cost competitive. A sustainable world has to be a stable world, a world that can continuously support life. We are changing the world in a diversity of ways, and a consequence of our changes in natural communities of the world is that we're also causing organisms to evolve. And if we want to understand and predict what the future will be like as a consequence of our changes, we have to understand not just the ecology, but also the evolution that we're causing. UCR has a rich history in agricultural research. We have field station facilities both on campus and down in the Coachella Valley. And we can combine those capabilities with the high-end academic environment and the genome resources center and the facilities on campus that allow us to do cutting edge research. We're right at the heart of where higher education can mean upward mobility. And you can get the same kind of education that you would at any first class research university. But it's one that's located in a place where we have an opportunity to be that doorway, that gateway to movement into middle class America in a way that very few other universities can be. It's important to try to make an impact in a positive way. This is an opportunity to really look for ways to produce something that can be good for future generations in terms of addressing the need for reliable and sustainable energy sources.